A bird escaping from its cage would be a nightmare for most pet owners. But Josh Cook is not like most pet owners. Josh has trained his blue and gold macaw, Mango, to fly freely on her own and return home. I finished the hand rearing process with her. She sees me as a close family member and as a result, I'm able to teach her free flight. Josh believes that allowing parrots to fly on their own is essential. They're said to have the intellect of a five-year-old child. And I mean, you wouldn't expect a child to stay in a room all day long and only come out when you got, you know, you're home from work. Mango takes unsupervised flights down to the local beach where she plays with children. Does she always come back home? She does. Unless she sees a nice group of people like yourself and she stops and says hello. She even stops for pictures with fans. She makes the sound of mobile phone cameras now. She really enjoys the, the attention. She's a bit of a diva, the old mango. Josh also trains birds for movies, television and private clients. I train their birds to free flight. So providing they meet the requirements and they're the right sizes and there's not uh, any predators in the area that's going to attack them, then I can go about training the birds. Josh lives with more than 50 exotic birds at his home in Sydney. This is where I live and this is where I conduct a lot of my bird uh, training. I've always admired birds and my father had kept birds. It just gave me a chance to see what special creatures they are. Josh's mother, Robin, has always been supportive of his career. He has a wonderful nature and a wonderful um, rapport especially with the birds. It's something like I've never seen before. Sometimes the house gets a bit noisy, but it's something we deal with. <laughs> the noise is only a small price to pay for what Josh gets in return from his birds. If you love something, let it go, and if it comes back, then you've got something there. So for me, it's very special and very rewarding. When you can build a relationship with these intelligent animals and also allow them the freedom of flight, you're combining both those things together and I just find that quite an escape from uh, the mundane.